I was born in Jamaica. Um, I'm actually born in a place called Frankfort Clarendon. And I came over here um, after my parents came. I then came to join them. And one of the things that I'm very, very keen to do is to celebrate Windrush. Welcome to my channel. Vlog Live 24-7. <laughs> right, guys. As you can see, this is Market Row. And we're just going inside to go to the Black Farmer Farm Shop. Quite in here compared to the main street there, <laughs> which you would expect. Here yeah, guys, look what I just stumbled across. This is for me mum. Because <laughs> she loves vinyl. She's got loads of vinyl records. Reggae and soca. Brazilian, African. Southern Soul, Chicago, all different vinyls from back in the day. Hey, look at this. Tracy Chapman, who remembers Tracy Chapman? Wonderful singer who drives a fast car. How you doing, my friend? My mum's a big vinyl freak, got loads of vinyl from back in the day. So when I saw this, I said, yes. And how are they doing now? What we were using them in the time that I've been, I've been playing records for, for a living for um, 30 years so I've been always buying records I never stopped there's just a whole load of new people buying them yeah, we're still playing them we lent this I think what's happened is those um, you know the, the new people have joined now people find records as their primary source of music music yeah like they were 30 or 40 years ago. yeah so there yeah. was a dip but those that crowd has come back into it it's doubled or tripled or whatever I guess yeah the, the, just the amount of people that are interested and a new record that's my record Right, okay. That's my, that, my record. Oh, that's your personal. That's my record of my music. Of your music, yeah. My yeah? Name's Andrew Ashong. It's an album I did with a guy called Johnny Drop. Right, okay. The Johnny Drop. Puzzle Dust. Andrew Ashong. And, and in the Puzzle shops, Dust. That's okay. a record. In the shops, that's £25. It's also a limited edition blue vinyl. Right. The actual record is blue. These are all your LPs that yeah. you purchased yourself? Yeah, one by and one. It, and then you're just. 30 years. 30 years. And then you're just obviously getting rid of them? Yeah, I'm just sort of constantly ended up downsizing that also makes it easier to be able to buy new records and not feel guilty yeah okay you yeah, know if yeah, i leave a shop with that many records yeah. to most most people that would look like a problem yeah. if i'm also selling selling like something 20 years yeah. ago that yeah. many then it's just balancing out great so that, that's so nice I've, my I've friend i've been really so i've got thousands of oh, oh, that's we're at the black farmer after that wonderful interview with andrew yes that's great so we are here and we're on our way in to see what's going on. Looks like there's loads of people here. Let's get this thing straight. Hello. It's all kicking off now, eh? One o'clock. That's great. Thank you. Uh, yeah, oh yeah. I'll try a little bit, of course. <laughs> Anything to try. Now, what is it? Is it? Fresh turmeric, fresh ginger. It's called jam gonna get it down here and try a bit. <laughs> very anti-inflammatory, helps with tonic, they can take a shot of each day. Yeah, Ooh. my grandfather all spices, so yeah. anti-inflammatory. Great, yeah. okay. Yep, tastes nice. Thank you. That's great, thank you. Right guys, this is it. We're here. Hello guys, I'm here with Wilfred. Can I call you Wilfred? Yes, you can. Yes. Thank you very much, sir. And I'm down here to be with Wilfred and the Black Farmer family to celebrate Windrush. Exactly, yes. Um, I'm of the Windrush generation. So I was born in Jamaica. Um, I'm actually born in a place called Frankfort Clarendon. And I came over here um, after my parents came. I then came to join them. And one of the things that I'm very, very keen to do is to celebrate Windrush. What I always say to people is this, is that what we all tend to forget is that everybody that came to this country in the 50s have to have a very entrepreneurial spirit in order to leave everything that's familiar, all your family and friends, in order to come to this country yep. to actually better your life and the life of your children. 
my mum came here, sorry, well, my mum came here at 19. Exactly. And they had yeah. to make it, yeah. And it's really important that we celebrate uh, these people because, as I said, for everybody that came, a lot of people didn't have the courage to come at all. So Windrush Day is a very, very important day to me. Yes, that's great. Thank you, sir. That's great. And to, to you and lots of other people. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you for the interview. It's a pleasure. Thanks, sir. Okay. So, yeah, so yeah. we're going to be doing some... These are the ladies behind the counter. <laughs> Who are you? A vlog, Vlog Life 247. So, what's so special about this granola? So, the nuts and seeds have been activated, and I'm not sure how much you know about activating. Hey, you're going to teach me? It goes through a soaking process, yeah. and it reduces digestion, removes the enzymes and inhibitors inside your body. Ah. So this granola is a very easy product, it has no additives, no preservatives, yeah. no sugars, it's all natural. All natural, best like way to go. Like Great. And is it obviously made by yourselves? Yes. Of course. Yes, of course. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're, what's the process of that? Do you do it in a factory? In a very or, small, or is in a very, very small, small batch, handmade, batches, yeah. in my kitchen. In the, yes, yes, okay. Yes. Yeah. And um, the shelf life is really small as well because there's no um, additives, additives there. yes exactly. yes as we know it's usually the additives it's that, additives that yeah. prolong affords it to stay there for like exactly. x months sort of thing great okay thank you thank you that's great yes very yes very nice isn't it <laughs> but, well i'm gonna try it now <laughs> thank you guys thanks very much yeah, yeah. Very nice. I must admit, I've got some here, and it tastes very, very nice. Huh? You need to buy something and stop just chatting. Hey, my brother, I've got to get the footage first, and then after no, that, no, hey, no, hey. No. <laughs> Right guys, I'm at the wall to show you what's on the wall. This is the Black Farmer Happy Wind Rush Day. So that's his from his website. I've seen that on anyway. Now let's see what pictures have been sent to him. Wow, Gloria Hanley in her finest. Great stuff. Gloria Hanley, right, she came from St. Kitts. I was born in Kayon, St. Kitts in 1948. Wow, just reading some of this. Severin Paul Del Sol, nice photo of him. Right, he was uh, his dad, so someone sent this and it's their dad. And they've written here, my daddy was born in the village of Scott's Head on the, the island of Dominica in the Caribbean Sea. Who's this? My daddy and his friends took a train from Southampton Station to Waterloo Station. That's great. A little bit of history there. I'm just going slow, guys, so you can read it. Just pause the video at your leisure and you can flick through what's been written. Specs of Windrush journey on Daddy's life. Lovely pictures, look at that. <laughs> Chairman of Dominica Development Association. That's great. And who is this? Dr. Stephen Paul Del Sol. I like that. I like that first word, doctor. Always good to hear of someone from the African or Caribbean and African continent with the heading doctor. Lovely stuff.
Right guys, we're going upstairs. Although we've been here before. I'm gonna get some of this punch, guys. It's gonna be my first, first port of call. I might try some of this cake though. Maybe we had it last time. I'm gonna get some of that punch. I don't know what, if there's any alcohol in there. Hey, my friend, any alcohol in there? It's got non-alcoholic No, <laughs> not that. Yeah, they don't want any tipsy patrons in here. There's one alcoholic and one that's not. Give me the alcoholic, brother. That's the only way to go, Ray and Nephew, my friend. Ray and Nephew. You know what I'm going for, guys? I'm going for alcoholic. So he's mixing it up just to make sure that obviously all that rum is mixed up in there. Wow. Lovely. Oh, it's stuck. Oh, please. Not for me. Not for me. And I can smell that rare nephew there, you know? I can smell it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's it. Yeah. Lovely. Thanks, my friend. Yes, Dave. Got a bit of rare nephew alcoholic, mate. Yeah, try some. It's, it's the spot, doesn't it? <laughs> it's the spot. Yeah, have some more. Definitely. That's nice. You're going out tonight. You don't want to get too tipsy before you go out. Definitely. I think I'll yeah. stay on the water now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Taylor Swift concert is going to later on. So he's got to be sharp. Just see if she saved it. All right, so all right, it's in the corner. All right, okay, I know where it is now. When I see you, you can tell me how you used it. Yes, I will do. Thank you, thank you, my dear. All the best, yeah. Thank you. Yes, please. Once it's got a black farmer symbol on it. Yeah, it does. Yeah, of course, I'll yeah, take that then. It is Percy Peters. Okay. Hey. It's worth it. <laughs> Have you found any food upstairs? Yes, I was just upstairs, yeah. Okay. Oh, is that for the hamper? Yes. Oh. Well, that's one of the prices. Oh. <laughs> I was sent one for free by Wilfred already. So, I had one. <laughs> a meat hamper. <laughs> wow. Yeah, wow. Really good. <laughs> I think you'll need your wife is wearing it there. Be the greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow up from the basement. Stay